Level 13, Lemmings on the Stream. Ooh, it's a Beast 2 level. These usually are interesting. And that's a lot of swimmers. Cool. And it's a one of everything level, but it has a stacker, so... I don't think I'm going to like this one. I like the chandelier, though. The upside-down one is pretty nice. Don't like the broken terrain. That was not what I was hoping for. But you know what? That might actually work well. Except, oh shoot, no one, no climbers, what? Why do we have a floater but not a climber? Let's see what becomes of this. That tr yeah, this tree I do not like as a piece of terrain. How does that even work? Also, I can't really figure out where the stacker is going to be used. That obstacle is going to be tough. Not if we save the miner, though. This is where I need to use my stacker. Holy crow. Nope. 
Ah, here we go. Here we go! Again, don't like the tree. Or don't like that tree, I guess I should say. Not really sure what the floater is used for. I'm gonna call that a back route then, since I didn't use the floater at all. But that was a decent bit easier than the other two levels, so... I think we... Let's see... Yeah, I'll do another. I'm in the mood to do another. Oh, this is Mother Brown, except it was changed to Mother O'Donoghue... Whatever. I don't know how to pronounce that. I wonder... Do I still have a replay of that? Maybe... That would probably be under stream levels. Uh, was that number level two? Level three, maybe? Level four. Oh, you used the lame honeycomb music. I really hope this replay is not broken. I love all the bees in the background, though. Let me re replay that since it happened so fast. There we go. Sure seems like this replay is going to work. Yep. Sweet! I'm so glad I had this old replay. <laughs> nice. And that's cool because this, um, my playthrough of this level is not actually on my YouTube channel. It got erased from my Twitch archive. Oh, the lazy level, I love it. Let's see... We're on level 15! 30 megsabyte hard drive. Interesting. This is definitely a megsabytes level. What the heck is this? Fire. That's a button. I do not like this tile set. How the heck am I supposed to get that button? Clever. Those are water? That's weird? But sure, we'll make one of these guys, a, both these guys a swimmer. You're swimming in bites? I got poor sap still stuck in there. 
Oh, please be an instantaneous teleporter. It is, but that's actually a bad thing. Okay. Oh, I see. Actually, wait. We're going to need to get them much closer together. I don't think that's going to even cut it, though. I did not hit R. Yeah, that's not going to work out. Actually, that one worked out in the first place anyways, because they were, they're going to just touch the fire. Are you saying we need to make a double trap of stoners? How are we going to turn everyone around at the start? With a stacker? I don't think so. Even at minimum release rate, one's still going to turn around. Wait, I'm sorry, what? Okay, that's dumb. If you're making lemmings coming out of the hatch at both sides, that better have, you better have a good reason for doing that. And not just, oh ho ho ho, what a trollish move, ho 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 ye ho ho. Doofuses come along. I don't want four doofuses coming along, but I really don't have a choice at this point, I guess. You don't climb back over that? It's a glider pickup. And then we can bash our way out of that. Wait, that's steel? That doesn't look like steel! supposed to reach that button. Are we seriously going to need the glider pickup skill? Only if way I can see that would be helpful is to get this button, except... Yeah.
So we use a platformer to get for there. Then we're gonna need to... Yeah, no, we used our last basher. That's not allowed. Because we're gonna need our last basher to get them out. That turns the computer on, it's just... Now there's no way for him to get out of here. I do not like this. Not one bit. The, the, the maze terrain is terrible. Also, the teleporter on this level is going to be the worst. Literally the worst. Not to promote my own stuff, but if you're going to use a teleporter, you're going to use the LEGO tile set teleporter, which is instant, as teleporters should be. None of this, oh, you got to wait like three seconds before the next one can come in. That's just going to waste time so they hit the water. Let's see, we're going to need one platformer to get over there, one platformer to get over there. That leaves us one platformer left. Actually, no, we don't need the platformer across there. They only will fall down and walk up. Then hit the maze. That's not good. Unless... Nope, they'll still get stuck. Yeah, they're gonna need a second platformer. Don't go on it! It's an interesting idea for a level, but I don't think it was executed very well, and I can't see any use for the glider. None. Like, you can do that, but now you're stuck. With no way to get out. And we've already lost both the lemmings we can lose. I 
just like that, the stormy levels went from being amazing to terrible. Oh, I see. I see. I still have no idea how everyone's getting in that teleporter, though. And I really don't think it's even possible for them to get into that teleporter. Because one's gonna enter, and then the others are all going to, well... Die! That's not good. I still have a digger left over? Oh yeah, duh. Oh. Alright. But now, guess what? They can't go to the exit because of the stupid teleporter. This would not happen if it was the Lego teleporter. Flopsy, when are you going to learn that teleporters are terrible? We'll make the most of it. But that's still not going to work out. Not even close, he still turns around. This is awful. I know you gotta make like a two platformer thing like that, and that way all the lemmings will be able to go in the teleporter without falling. But that's gonna leave me one platformer short for this part. Hmm. 
I feel like I have all of the tricks figured out, more or less, on for this level. This is much more promising. Here we go. Nope, he climbs That's not good. Oh my, I think that's too spread apart to work. But you know what, we'll just see. Wow. This level's ridiculous, and you know this, Flopsy. Let's see, we're still going to need one, two, okay, we're still going to need one, two, three, four, five. So we actually can't use the platformer to turn around here. That doesn't seem right now, does it? Actually, no way. We don't need a platformer on the top. Well, yeah, we kind of do. Yeah, we still need the last platformer to be there. Well, we do have a digger to spare. How do we have a digger to spare? Well, if we have a digger to spare, we're gonna do this. Well... We're gonna do this. Okay. It's almost a bit better than I originally gave it credit for, but not by much. I still don't like this turn that Stormy has taken. And... 
I do like how it boots up the copy of Lemmings when you win. Or when you unlock the exit. I still don't approve of the teleporter, though. Alright. That was a clever puzzle, but again... I don't like teleporters, and I do not like that graphic set. So I'm not going to like the level. That's just the way it's going to be. Anyhow, that's all the time we have for today. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Color Forty. Tune in next time. Actually, how many Stormy levels do we have from left? Oh, we only have four. Oh, we'll finish Stormy in the next episode. Cool. Have a great day, and God bless.